everyone. Welcome back to Show Me How to Win. We're visiting Taiwan and we're in Taichung City. Next to me is Jason. He's the chief editor at Multi Games. They're famous for their family games that can be enjoyed by both adults and children. So they're bringing two games to Essen this year, Essen 2018. And we're checking out Horticulture Master. It's a beautiful game. And Jason, can you tell me a little bit about the story behind Horticulture Master? Oh, 这个游戏它是一个就是我们用大自然的一个元素然后呢把它带入到一个园艺里面因为园艺师呢它会一直不断地向大自然取材然后把最美的元素带入到我们的生活里面然后如果你想要成为一个园艺大师的话呢你的园
And how many tool cards are in each uh, deck? 几张呃工具？哎、欸，我们工具的话，每一种工具它都有两张。嘿，所以如果你没有办法在一开始去拿取到工具的话，其实你也不用太担心，你没办法玩游戏。那你就是尽力的去收集这个绿色的卡片，去给你的对手去跟他做一个交换的动作就可以了。Okay, so sounds like to summarize to control the tools, and if you have the chance to grab the fire and、uh, ice cards, are good ways to go. But if you can't, make sure you get the、uh, wild cards when you have a chance. Also, to turn your smaller points card tiles into larger tiles are good ways to go because、uh, you only have so many areas to build your、um, garden, right? So in order to Make this little garden have the most po most points as you can. You must、uh, turn some turn some garden over so that you can get more points at the end. All right, thank you so much, Jason, for showing me how to win at Horticulture Master. This game is beautiful. It has really really beautiful art, cute animals, and、uh, these animals are actually a little variant that you can add to.、Uh, Your game after you play a few rounds, there are one points each, and you can、uh, basically place an animal on one of the tiles. And if you're the first person to build it, you will actually get bonus points. But that is variant. But just another way to make the game a little bit more interesting. So looking forward to trying this one out at Essen. Thank you so much for watching. Okay, bye bye. Bye.